Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Tiana Michelle here. So today I'm going to be showing you how I created this flower memorial shadow box for my daughter who unfortunately passed away in August. Um, so I'm going to be showing you how I created this. It was really simple to do. It took me about 20 minutes. So I'll show you what I am using and then we'll get into the video. So the supplies that you're going to need are a shadow box. I picked this up from Michael's. It was regularly $15.99. They had a 60 or 50% 50 off coupon. So it was $8. Michael's always has coupons. So you can always... Michael's always has their frames and shadow boxes on sale. So you can always get these on sale. This is an 8x8. Eight eight and they come in different sizes. But for today I'm going to be using an 8x8. Eight eight. You're also going to need a glue gun you're gonna need glue sticks and I picked up these butterflies at Dollar Tree I also got these glue sticks at Dollar Tree um a pair of scissors just in case you're also gonna need a foam board I got that from Dollar Tree as well I'm gonna be using a black foam board and I also picked up these flowers from Dollar Tree Okay, so the first thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to take the back off of the shadow box and I'm going to measure it on the foam board so I can get a perfect measurement for the 8x8. Eight eight. Alright, so I'm just going to take the back off of this. And this already has like a push cushion to it, but I don't think it's uh, deep enough for, for the use that I need it for. So I'm just gonna use this back to um, measure out the foam board. And I'm gonna do that off camera and I'll be back. Okay, so I've already cut out my foam board and I'm just gonna make sure that it's gonna fit inside of my shadow box. And it's a perfect. All right, so I've already gone ahead and did the first row. It's super, super easy. So what I do is you need something to poke the holes in the foam board because um, the flowers are super flimsy, so they won't poke the hole. So basically what I'm doing is poking a hole and then I'm going to remove the stem or the flower from the stem. Real easy. Then I'm gonna take a little bit of glue. Actually, I need to widen the hole a little bit. So I'm just gonna widen the hole with the stem from the flower. And then I'm gonna take a little bit of glue, not a lot. Just a little bit to fill the hole. And then I'm going to place the flower in the hole and then hold it, hold it push it down and then hold it in place so that it stands up correctly it doesn't fall over and it just kind of um just keep it in place and then now you can see that it's like in place so I'm just going to continue that for now
and do next is I'm gonna take this picture I'm just using this picture from the obituary and I basically folded it in half and I'm gonna tape it down to the board and then I'm gonna continue on with the flowers and place more flowers around the picture so that it fills in the black hole and I'm gonna be using this tape but you can use any kind of tape you can use foam dots whatever you choose but for me I'm gonna use this double sided tape Okay, so I'm pretty much done for the most part. Um, I do have some gaps that I want to fill in, so I'm probably gonna break off some of the stems from the flowers and fill in, fill in the gaps. So here's what it looks like outside of the shadow box. I'm gonna put it inside. I kind of like it like this. 
without the shadow box but i'm gonna put it in the shadow box and see how it looks and you guys will let me know which way you like better All right, so the flowers are too long. So this is how it looks if I don't push in the flowers. And then this is how it looks after I push in the flowers. So this is what it looks like after I push in the flowers, kind of covering her face. So I'm going to have to rearrange it or maybe take some of the flowers out. Now I'm trying to decide if I want to add these butterflies or not. Um, I'm not sure. Maybe I'll put them on the ends. Maybe just one. I think that's all I'm gonna do for this. If I decide to add letters on it, I'll show that final product, but 